What's going on, people in that? Okay, um, yeah, so I came in, had to talk to me. I had to talk to him back. Uh, and it didn't give me enough time to explain my build before the <laughs> match started. Anyways, so this will be a double tier build. So, hopefully, this will be a lot of fun. Hopefully, uh, it should be a lot of fun. So it's more definitely more late game oriented, and I took fleet of footwork because I'm not going to be getting any type of healing in this build except for fleet of footwork. But I will be doing like AP and crits, and it'll, it'll, it'll be a fun build. Oh my gosh, auto! There we go. Beautiful. Basically, I'm supposed to be like kind of tanky. But like also not. And I'm also supposed to be dealing a lot of damage. I don't know. It'll just be a fun build. Ow, I didn't blind him fast enough. There we go. And that was beautiful. And that blind literally saved my life. What is that one? I think it lets me play a little bit more aggressive than what I probably should. Especially against an orb. Let you have them, okay. Okay, Orn does have teleport, so me staying is kind of useless. Oh well. I don't think he'll catch up on CS fast enough though. Alright, so let's get this first tier under our belt. And actually, I think we're going to want to go for man immune first, since I'm more of an auto attack focused. Plus, once I get man immune, then I'm actually immediately going for Archangels. Well, nice thing is the uh, the mana changes aren't to live servers yet, so I'm actually going to be able to uh, do this build way easier than normal. You know, I don't even care that I took this much damage. Ready. 
Oh, there he is. Okay, maybe I should have cared that I took that much damage. <laughs> Uh, okay. I saw a teleport. Here we go. Too early. Oh, there he is. There you go. Thank you. I get this pushed out. I use my abilities without missing this. Mm, awful. All right, this one there, and there, and head back. Cause I think I have enough, and I do. Oh yeah. No. Now I can start building into my next tier item, Archangel. <laughs> so by the way, this item actually does work pretty well on Teemo because not only does he auto attack a lot, so this just gives him more AD. It will put a AD uh, attack basically on his Q. Uh, his ultimate is still just strictly AP. It'll also give me more AP in the long run and give me some mixed damage against this guy. Where he can't just build one type of build. Dang it. Dang it. Now I do realize I'm probably going to be pretty weak. Let's, let's get this second tier out though. Actually, no. What's the point? No. Yeah, okay. I just, I just not thought about it. It's not really a point. So, I will go for Ginsu's. Because the Gensus, um, albeit won't give me any um, cooldown reduction. Wait, I thought this one was supposed to. I think the other one gives you 20%. It does. Yeah. But I want to get Gensus because it'll apply the mirror mana twice on hit. So. That'll be really nice. Uh, place one here. Stacking this mirror man is going to be really nice.
and I keep on missing the blind, which is not good. Yeah, I need a way, way more reserve than what I have been, to say the least. And instead of attack speed, I probably should have went with the uh, the bloodthirst. I mean, I kind of want to help mid, but I feel like I'd get wrecked too. So I'm just gonna play passively top. And bot lane's doing really good, which is awesome. hate this because he could just literally rush on me. <sighs> Actually, I can get for my I can go for my other attack speed item. Which is Phantom Dancer. Which will reduce his damage by a little bit and give me crits. And you know, since I'm stacking AD at this point, crits are probably uh, in my best interest, especially even with my flea of footwork. There, there, here. I mean, it's only a tax feed item I'm going to be getting. And that feels bad, man. <laughs> uh, we are probably way too far pushed off anyways. Just gonna mute both of them. Because they're not contributing to the team. Whatsoever. In positive ways. So. Don't need none of that. Anyways, this build uh, so far is probably not good going against AD. Or armor is what I should say. But I don't know. Again, this is more of a late game oriented build. Just, just for fun. You know. So I know it's not supposed to work. Like really well. I'll probably improve on it. Like for example, if I'm going with the AD version first. Uh, then I should probably you know, be 
maybe go for the um, bloodthirst mastery. Yeah, probably would have been better. Uh, oh well. <laughs> Actually, not doing too awful. It's this guy now. I mean, you know, if I just dodge his abilities. <laughs> as easy as that, right? Just, just gotta dodge his abilities. Cool, Zed went back to lane. I mean, I can't really fight this guy at this point. I mean, yeah, he's got, you know, anti-armor items, and that's all I'm building is AD. Yeah, I see that he's missing right. He went bot lane. Dang it. <sighs> well, now I got Phantom Dancer. And now I can start going for my second tier item. Actually, I should probably start with this. And then get that. Some boots. Because why not? Get some more AP. Oh wow, I'm still scaling off of AP too, for adaptive. That was, ooh, that's actually almost stacked up. That'll be nice. That was a really good trim place. Alright, give me the wave. I'll get two. One and two. There you go. And I have my mirror mana fully stacked. Now then, I don't think it keeps its passive of stacking AP. It does not. So that means in order to stack my second one, I have to be spamming abilities. Yeah. 
definitely take that. <laughs> and he's literally just walking into all of them. Alright. I really need all this farm though. Try and get this tier stacked up. Alright. I mean, once I, you know, upgrade it to the full item, I'll start stacking it a lot faster. But for now, I won't be stacking that fast. Hmm, why was I slowed there? Oh, probably Lulu. There we go. He just got outplayed. She's dead. <laughs> okay. And the good old smiley face. Try and grab this. There you go. Go ahead and back here and get my Archangels, which will be very nice. All right, and then now. I want to build my Rage Blade. I don't really need like to upgrade my boots. You know, I have my passive. Which gives me enough on it. So. Ow. Still dealt a lot of damage to him, actually. One gen. Good job, Jen. I feel like he's not gonna work out so hot. There we go. Actually, that went a lot better than I thought it would. Awesome. Great job. Team. Huh. Yes.
There we go. Oh, I just realized how much AD this or on hit damage this is this build's gonna be. Can't do anything about that. Of course not up for a little while. And then, oh the once in a while crits are gonna are gonna do a lot. And once I get this fully stacked. Oh yeah. It'll be a, it'll be a good time, and plus the new rage blade actually benefits from me having oh, multiple things. Probably able to take this. Yeah, because they're like all ball in. I can do some dangerous things here. Right up, darn. It is not. Ooh, but these are up. How much? I got a grade. Twenty three hundred. Okay. Oh, their ADC does a lot. I need to get close in order to take her out. I forgot where the basically the trap team because we got Jin and Timo on the same team makes the game that much more interesting. I mean, let's see, Orn engages. I don't think it'll go so well for our team. Like this. There you go. That was a beautiful shroom. Beautiful shroom. <laughs> uh, all right. Darn. That tower is gone. I would take this one too. Oh yeah. Darn. No goodies for us to plunder. Ah, oh, here we go. Awesome. Ooh, that's almost fully stacked too. Okay. You and there we go. All right, now I have my Ginsu's. Let's see. I think I do want to build this into some Ninja Tavis. Ninja Tavi seems really good this game. And, <laughs> oh, I can't wait to listen. Completed. Actually, if this plants up, oh. Yeah. 
Hmm. Watch out for Zed. He's behind us. There you go. On my way. I can do it without me, right? I'm actually really excited for this build now. The build's almost completed. All right, so for the last item, build a frozen mallet. Give me some extra oomph of tankiness. I go ahead and pick my, my build. I'll let, I'll let him have it. Oh my gosh, yeah, look at that. And I get more AD and AP on my auto attacks, which will attack twice. Uh, and I get the crits every once in a while. Yes, please. Ooh, actually. I don't know. You know. What's our team look like? Okay, yeah, it'll be a really good item. Instead of a frozen mallet, what if I got a frozen heart? Give me that extra 20%. item seems way better plus it'll actually give me a little bit more burst and give me more mana which increases my damage oh yeah armor it's more gauntlet yeah and it'll stop me from being bursted by zed by a lot Especially with the ninja tabbies that I have. Oh yeah. Actually, I think I'm going to go with this item first. Because, you know, it'll give me a little bit more mana, which goes into... Actually, how much does it give me? Let's see, 8 and... Okay, so it gives me 5 AD and 8 AD. But I mean, I gotta think that I also get went all the way up to twenty four percent extra. On my way. Oh, my AD and my MP. Push out top. Bot lane's already pushing. There. They're all top side, so that's... Or they're all bot side, which lets me free push top. That really sucks. They're all still bot. Oh man, that's why.
Oh yeah, team's got it. Team don't need me. There we go. I wonder if I could bait this guy. Okay, now I definitely need to back off though. I don't know where his entire team is. And I think I have enough of my item. Which I oh yeah, look, look at this build. This build is freaking disgusting. <laughs> oh, this build's actually awful, but I love it. That's not good. I'm I'm here, team. <laughs> yeah. Now I take a lot of no damage. Oh yeah. Yeah, a little overzealous there. That's okay. Oh man, and the attack speed from. What's his face? Oh yeah. Oh, it almost gets me to the attack speed cap. Which is awesome. Oh my gosh! That took out so much of her health. It's actually really good that the team's doing that. Yeah, I'll let Rise take that. I'm full build. <laughs> Let's see this. Alright. Unmute these guys because now we're at a stable point, so maybe they're not as toxic towards each other. Dang it. That's not good. That's not GG. They don't have any lanes pushed in. It's not G. I have no lane. No lane pushed. All right, they'll get tower in, in an inhib. By that point, we'll be up to defend it. Let's defend that point. All right.
That's not good. There you go. Yeah, we really need Jin. <laughs> I'm full build, I'll let them take it. Only person that isn't is Nunu. -Nu. Dang it. <laughs> Alright, I think it's about time I sold these ninja tabbies. But what am I getting instead? Probably want some health. But what health item? No, I don't think Morello. I mean, I could just <laughs> go more mugs and call it good. <laughs> hmm. Or a pretty decent replacement, which is Dead Man's. I mean, do I even have enough to do that? You're pretty close. So what does that sell for? 770? Wow, okay. Just get a little bit more farm and get dead man's. There we go. Really need a back though. Here, sell this and get a demo. There we go. My movement speed definitely went down, but that's okay. Actually, a pretty good item. Actually. I don't know, I feel like more health would just be useful. He's dead. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do that later. You know I do lose out on my 20% cooldown reduction and some Extra damage. I feel like the health is going to be way more worth it. Yep, I'm running back. Close your deer. Not. Actually, what if I just got a gun blade? You know, it sounds weird and pretty stupid. But, you know, since I have scalings on everything and 
a lot of damage being pumped out and not enough survivability. Actually, I think it's a pretty good trade. Oh, never mind. Apparently, I don't enough. I'll just clear up mid. This rise. There you go. That's all for her. Okay, I think I should have enough now. Bye. Thank you. Alright. I'm only doing this because the game is really, really close. And a very long game at that, too. I mean, as long as you take him off Baron, that's what matters. I don't know what else they would be doing, though. Those crits are really good. God, I need to shroom bot lane really fast. Actually, no, that's good. Because we can't do anything. They will beat us for sure. As long as they have Baron. Unless we can catch someone. Which, in that case, that's the best case scenario. Oh, should be. Like, Rakan and Nunu are the ones that need to be up front. Realize if Nunu buffs me, <laughs> so I'm AP attack, attack speed. At least that's what I benefit off of. Alright. Wow. I have that many guardian angles. Oh man, and I forgot they have Orn on their team, so they all get one really good item.
I don't want to go off. I was holding on to it too, for way too long. That is GG. Dang it. Darn. Well, is this build good? Uh, absolutely not. Is it fun? Absolutely yes. Should you play it? Um, well, if you if you already want to do a troll pick, you know, the, the Teemo is the character that you should play. But if you if you want to troll your team even more, this build definitely does it. And it does good. And not in a way that you're useless, but in a way that, you know, you don't feel that effective. So, how about my damage? Alright. Alright, very true. The game was way too long. <laughs> oh, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a lot of fun making this. Kind of had this concept of a build before, and I changed it definitely a lot during the game. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you all in the next one, everybody.